Lesson 6 Symmetry, Patterns and Nets We see shapes with symmetry all around us. Fold a leaf into two along its length or observe your face in the mirror. We see patterns on fabric prints. Open up a carton or a toothpaste box and see how its shape has been drawn and cut. Lines of Symmetry we have learned how to identify and draw a line of symmetry. A line along which two parts of a shape can completely and exactly overlap is called a line of symmetry. Are these lines of symmetry in the given figures? Cut out these shapes on paper and fold them along the given lines. Check if the two halves completely overlap. More than one line of symmetry. Some objects and shapes may show more than one line of symmetry. Draw and cut out a paper square with side 5 cm. Fold it in different ways to get equal halves. Draw lines along the folds which give equal halves. How many lines of symmetry do we get? Now try the same with a cut out of a circle. How many lines of symmetry do you think are possible? One line of symmetry is marked. How many more are possible? Turning shapes. Shapes may be rotated around a fixed point to complete one revolution or circle. The turn may be clockwise or anti-clockwise. The turns are measured at a quarter. 1 by 4, half, 1 by 2, or full. Quarter turn is equal to 1 right angle, 1 by 4, 90 degree. Half turn is equal to 2 right turns, 1 by 2, 180 degree. 3 quarter turn is equal to 3 right angles, 3 by 4, 270 degree. One full turn is equal to four right angles, 360 degree. Some shapes look the same at certain turns. They show rotational symmetry. Example 1. Rotate the given shape. Check if it shows rotational symmetry. The given shape takes three positions on different rotations. Zero turn, one turn, quarter, two turns, half, 3 turns, 3 quarters, 4 turns, full turn. Since the shape looks the same at each turn, it shows rotational symmetry. Example 2. Check if the given shape shows rotational symmetry. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Since the shape does not look the same at each rotation, it does not show rotational symmetry. Patterns. When a shape or set of shapes is or are repeated in a fixed order, they form a pattern. Patterns may be formed by order of changing colors, shapes, increase, decrease, rotation and so on. Patterns are also made by numbers and letters. Nets. Shalu opened up a toothpaste cover. This is how it looked. Close 3D view. Open 3D view. Flat 2D view. Net. A net is a 2D drawing of a 3D object. The faces and edges on the net are the same as on the 3D object. Here are the nets of some simple 3D objects. Cube. Net of a cube. Cylinder. Net of a cylinder. Cone. Net of a cone. Views of 3D shapes. 3D shapes or solids may look different from different angles of viewing. The three standard views of solids are the front view, top view, 
and the side view. Each of these views is at exact 90 degree with the front, top and side. Top view T, side view S, front view F, front view, side view, top view. The three views of a matchbox. Example 4. Draw the front, top and side views of the given solids. T, F, S, front, top, side. 2, T, F, S, side, top, front. Drawing 3D Shapes To draw 3D shapes with perspective in depth, we use an isometric dot paper. The dots in this paper are arranged in a way that the 3D shapes appear in depth. To draw a solid, 1. Start with any one edge. 2. Extend lateral edges backwards. 3. Draw remaining edges to complete the shape. Example 5. Using an isometric paper, draw the 3D view of a cuboid with length 4 units, breadth 3 units and height 1 unit. Start with drawing the edge showing the height of 1 cm. Extend 4 units backwards on the right. Extend 3 units backwards on the left. Complete the drawing by drawing remaining edges.